Late night, date night. I'm not gonna let you burn We're gonna go see the midnight showing of Mocking Day. Trevor, don't drop your camera in the glasses of water that are under the camera right now. Uh, you're so, so beautiful. I wear way too much makeup to go to this movie. I know I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry too. I know I will. I like sobbed when Rue died in the last one. Spoiler alert. <laughs> if you haven't seen it by now, something's wrong with you. We're gonna get food before the midnight showing and welcome to sleep already. We're at we're at Whiskey Cake, which is like a kind of a cool local restaurant in OKC. Mm -hmm. You know how we do. Separated. Bye. Okay. Megan had a good idea to vlog the epic burger, <laughs> burger that I'm about to eat. And I have no regrets about it. Uh, hold on, your eyes are messed up. <laughs> there you go, that's better. Thanks a lot, Cannon. Why don't you make a camera that the thing doesn't close? Yes. And just like that, it was gone. Movie magic. Ha. It's big. It is big. It's so round that I think we could paint a basketball on it and it would look like a basketball. This is what you come to this restaurant for. It's a whiskey cake. I don't remember what's in it, but it's delicious and it's got homemade whipped cream on top and Trevor's never had it before. Let's see what he thinks. Try it, Trevor. Try it. Ah! Oh my gosh. I can't take you anywhere. I thought I was supposed to get whiskey with this. It's whiskey is in it. Not bad. This guy is ridiculous. Not bad. I guess I'll eat it all. It's all mine now. Okay. <laughs> Ew, don't do that. Okay, now I'm gonna eat the cake. Because it's delicious. Oh, I guess I can eat it in front of you. You gonna watch? So good. I should know to never listen to Megan whenever I drive. She just, oh, I did park like a douche. <laughs> Whatever. I tried my best, y'all. Anyway, Megan was making me go down the wrong way in a parking garage, and we got caught by the security guard, and he He's made like, us turn around. <laughs> made, there's no traffic. It is midnight almost. And he's like, wrong way. We're like, really? It's 11.30. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> we are here at the theater now. AMC over at Penn Square. I'm not even sure you can read that. But we're going to get our tickets, and we're here like... 45 minutes early, and we're gonna just piddle. I'm gonna have to pee like four times. Probably. Before it starts. And then I'm just gonna suck it up during the movie. Yeah. Just bring a bunch of napkins with you. It'd be Dang fine. it, I should have brought a depends. Yeah. Anyway, we're gonna go to the movie now. Hey, have you guys seen the bump lately? It's like legit, dude. That is a, it? Yep, that is a legit bump. Ugh, it's so big. I'm so bad. Can you see? Can you see? Can you see? So these, the this the these theaters, this theater has super comfy seats. Let me demonstrate. Demonstrate okay. for us. Hold my purse, Trevor. Very yeah. nice. Yeah. How's that feel? Good. <laughs> You're gonna go to sleep. Yeah. I should take a nap before the um, the movie starts. <laughs> you should. I think I might too. All right. How do you feel, Trevor? We just finished. It's all right. Mocking Jay. You know, like the first one best. <laughs> I want your reaction. <laughs> My reaction. I'm so sad. <laughs> just because it's a sad story. They did a really good job on the movie. That's all I'm gonna say because otherwise I'll ruin it for somebody else who hasn't seen it yet. We've read the books. Yeah, I listened to them. Yeah, I read them in like four days. All of them in like four days. And then I was like, wait, what? And then I listened to them. Yeah, so leave it in the comments below. Have you read the books? What did you think of them? Are you gonna go see the movie? Go watch it, you should go watch it. 
they do a really good job. I'm sorry, I'm really sleepy. We are old and should not be going to a midnight showing. Right before the movie started, like, there's all these girls in there, and I'm kind of like, there's I like, am old and sleepy. I, I want to go to bed. Right <laughs> yeah, there's like a bunch of girls having a sleepover tonight, to, and they came to see the Hunger Games Mocking Day. They're all in their pajamas and blankets and stuff, and I was taking like, taking selfies. You know, it's funny. I, I was, told Trevor, <laughs> that's our future. Yeah. We're gonna be the parents bringing our teenage daughter and her crazy annoying friends. To the movies at midnight. Because <laughs> we'll be those, we'll be those parents. Yeah. I had a thought. I saw a bunch of people taking a bunch of selfies, right? Mm -hmm. And a lot of them, they've got it down. Like they've got, they'll have three people behind them, and they'll stand in front, and they'll have the camera. Yeah. Right. And so it's like, oh, okay, I get the angle, I, I see. It. And I started thinking, like our lives are like The Sims now, like. What they were doing made me think of this playing The Sims and like their hokiness and cheesiness in the game. And I was just like, huh, interesting. We we thought we were creating a game called The Sims to recreate life, but no, we are becoming The Sims. We're just robots oversharing our lives. Is that what you're saying? Yeah, turn it off. We don't want to share my life with you. <laughs> Is vlogging technically like the ultimate selfie? It is. It is. Well, like, I already have issues with, like, uh, taking a selfie in public. So to vlog in public is, like, that much harder. Yeah. Because not only am I trying to just capture a moment in time, a split second in time, I'm conversing with... with Seemingly nobody. Yeah, yeah. It looks so People probably so think crazy. I, I put it all together and, like... Watch on my own computer and like yes. by yourself. I, I did have, so good on that. I have friends. <laughs> I'm friends with myself. Yeah. Like. <laughs> Are you the dude that likes his own photos? Like likes them. Oh, I did that on accident. I the saw other day. you actually. I was like, Dang it! I was like, Megan. It's already been done. So I would say that if you're a Hunger Games fan, go see this movie. If you've seen the first two movies, go see it. If you haven't, watch the first two movies and then go see it. Because otherwise you're going to be like, what? What the heck what? is going on? It's worth seeing, I would say. I think it was, I think it was very good. I want to go see it again. I do too. I feel like I missed details probably. In between, I, like, in between yawning. Yeah, so I actually was like very awake during the movie, but as soon as it was over, I'm like, I'm so exhausted. Me too. Did you cry, Trevor? There were a couple moments that I, I whelped up. I never, I don't think any tears fell. I did not cry as much as I expected to, because with Catching Fire, I like pretty much sobbed through the whole movie. Okay, YouTube, I think we're going to say goodbye. Yes? Yes. For the night? Yes. And I will charge the battery in my camera and I will vlog tomorrow how tired I am after watching The Hunger Games. Hey, Trevor editing this. Was it worth it? Alright. We will... Talk to you later. Talk to you later. Bye.